This date is nice, but it would be a lot nicer if we were in the hot tub. She's not even eating my spaghetti that I worked so hard on. She's completely ignoring it. All right, let's go in the hot tub, though. Time to take this date to the love tub. It's one of the best seats in the house. The love tub. Dang. Naomi about to get it. In the love tub. Get in. Get into my love tub. Thank you. That first kiss knocked me off my feet. I think we should try that again and again and again and again. I think the makeout session I ordered for this date is overdue. I'm going for it. Let's go for it. I think we're gonna get it. Makeout. Oh man. <gasps> Naomi, I didn't know you had it in you. <laughs> Dang, where's Samantha? Why do I feel like she's somehow watching? Nice. Um, Naomi's definitely the one for me. Sometime soon, I'm going to have to confront Samantha and make sure she knows to leave me alone. Vincent, after I left the bowling alley, I met this strange lady who said she needed some bus fare to get back to Sim City. So I bought this really amazing mask from her. I thought it would look great hanging up over your bar, so I want you to have it. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. What did that strange woman look like? Good night, Vincent. I've had a wonderful evening. Jack, Jack. Chapter 9. Now that was a date. I really think there's something to Naomi and me. And I really hope she feels the same way. I'm wondering if Samantha is going to go ballistic or if she's keeping herself distracted with Johnny Collin. I'm sure I'll find out at the worst possible time. Yes, I'm sure you will find out at the worst possible time. A uh, what? Call the police. Call the police. We have a burglar. We have a burglar. Emergency. Emergency. We'll be there as soon as we can. Be careful. Burglars can be dangerous. Where are they? What are they taking? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh! Hell no! Get out of here! Nice. I don't think they got anything. Burglar has been caught. You get a $500 reward for helping the police track down a known criminal. Nice! Alright, take a shower and we're off to bed. Dang. Samantha must have sent her. Ever get that feeling that you should check your email? I just did. Oh yeah, I do get that feel. I've gotten that feeling before, or like you, like I don't know, check like um your messages on like I don't know one of the social medias. You just get that feeling, and then you uh, you you always have something. So weird. I fortuitously overheard a tete a tete in which certain cognoscenti discussed a connubial union between Samantha and Johnny. Yes, the two are actually, as Greg would phrase it, tying the knot. <laughs> okay, Sherman. Samantha getting married so soon and to my chief competitor? I should invite her over and make sure that she's not just doing this to get under my skin. How about we just don't invite her over, Greg? How about you for, like, quit her and forget her? She's done. She's gone. Calling her over is going to make things much worse, but okay, here we go. I should invite Samantha over to make sure that she can have a, we can have a clean break once she's married. She can't keep ruining my date just to use with Johnny. Yeah. I mean, she hasn't been ruining our dates. I think she finally stopped. Maybe if she does it again. I know, just call her over. Alright, let's see. I hope I'm not making a mistake by inviting her over here. <laughs> sure, what's that? Or what is that? Worry. Oh, here she goes. Oh no! Oh, she's actually wait, I thought she was gonna come right in. Creep on my daddy bits. No you already had your chance with me, Vincent. What do you want? Well, uh, <laughs> the only way to say it is just get it out. Samantha, congratulations on your engagement. I hope you and Johnny work out. I just want to make sure this isn't something you're doing to try to hurt me. 
You are never capable of making your own decisions, Vince. You think you can just brush me off and go for a poor barista? You're clueless. Oh god, here she goes. Well, that could have gone better. What was I expecting, though? This isn't going to get resolved easily at all. Stop laughing at me! Why me? That's it. She's out of here. You're out of here. You hear that, Samantha? You're out of here. Wait, let me talk to Brittany really quick. Hey, girl. <laughs> okay, I'm kicking Samantha out of my house. She can't talk about Naomi that way. I'm asking Samantha to leave. We need to leave right now. Samantha, I'm tired being nice to you, but I'm not going to let you talk about Naomi that way. I think you should leave now. You're kicking me out for that coffee jockey? Oh, no, you did not just say that. Oh, uh, yeah, except I did. I'll show you, you big jerk. No one treats Samantha Hayden like this and gets away with it. Oh, God. Call the police. Just call the police. Emergency. Emergency. Samantha, what are you doing? Oh, God, call the police. You like playing sweet music for your precious coffee girl so much. Let's see how you do without it. Okay, call the police. This bitch is crazy. Help me. We'll be there as soon as we can. Yeah, they're here. Help me. Oh, no, Samantha, please. Can't we just wash your hands of each other and be done with this? Oh, no. You want me to wash your hands of me? Do you wash this? <gasps> $500 for calling when there was no emergency. Um, excuse me. There's a psycho bitch in my home. What do you mean there's no emergency? Why the long face? Wow. What? A he's giving her a... Is he like... I think he's giving her a pass. He's like, uh, <laughs> deal with it, bitch. Asshole. Fine. Whatever. Useless ass police. Oh my god, good. I'm glad it's spraying all over her. Samantha, what's wrong with you? Get out of my ass now or I'm calling the police. The way we did that, they didn't give a shit. You want to bring the hate? I brought some matches. Oh my god, no. Goodbye forever, Vince, you numbskull. Oh, thanks, police. Thank you. Thank you very much. You know, she's an arsonist. Thank goodness that's over. Samantha's a walking disaster. But at least she's gone for good. And I don't have to be reminded of her anymore. Uh-huh. What a psycho. Must have been a brutal party in here. <laughs> Dude, you must have a great girlfriend. She bought all this great stuff for you. What? There's a note attached to the guitar. Dear Vince, I will love you forever and ever. After meeting you, I'll never be able to think about another guy again. You really ground me and keep me sane. I'm so glad I'm going to be your wife. Can't wait to hear you some, play some sweet music for me on this guitar. It plugs right into the stereo. I love you, sweetie XOXOXO Samantha. <laughs> is this like delayed order? She is not my girlfriend anymore. How did she go from being so nice to starting fires in my house? What a psycho. Chapter 10. That didn't go so well, but what was I expecting, really? It's odd that she seems so into Johnny, yet she's trying so hard to get back at me. I wonder what Johnny thinks of this, or does he even think about it at all? Nah, Johnny's just laying down the dickings. He doesn't care. What is Samantha thinking? I definitely appreciate Naomi now more than ever, and I can't wait to show her just how much. <laughs> how much? How much, Vincent? How much? All right, go to sleep. This has been too much. I need, I need, oh my gosh, we need to call a repairman. We could repair it ourselves, I guess. I'll do that. Why well, we do have work though. We're well, getting really good at repair. Dude, did you hear about Samantha and Johnny's honeymoon? What? No, nor do I care, Greg. No, I do care. It sounds dramatic. Oh, so you didn't hear about Johnny's company going under and him flying right back here to find out what was going on? What? <laughs> what? Yeah, it turns out the success of your satellite caused a lot of investors to pull out of bit tech. They, they bombed overnight, dude. Ha! Sucker ass bitches. Hell yeah. Yeah, so I kind of got a date with Lex tonight, so I got to get going. Wish me luck, dude. I'm out. Good luck. Vincent, it's Naomi. Could you meet me at the mall? There's a pogo stick here. You just have to jump on. Glad you called. Sure, I'll head on over to Arcadian Plaza. All right, let's go. 
Naomi certainly seems to be in a playful mood. I'll try to meet up with her while she's in such good spirits. Let's go. I'm in good spirits, too. My business competitor is done. My psycho girlfriend is done. Oh, well, ex-girlfriend. Now we got a nice one. It's good to see you again, Vincent. Oh, I believe I have a few kisses for your lovely arm, Naomi. Duh, how wholesome. Up arm. Those up arm kisses are quite romantic. I wonder if Naomi would appreciate one. Aw. So sweet. Naomi seemed to appreciate my gesture. She's a really wonderful person to be around. Somehow I knew I wouldn't be able to go. Oh no. Somehow I knew I wouldn't be able to go out tonight without seeing Samantha. There's going to be another an argument tonight one way or another and I might as well be the cause of it. Here we go. Here we go. Oh look, good. You have a good time, we'll have a good time. How about that? Oh hey Brittany. I'll irritate that pesky pest Samantha. She's got it coming after messing up my house like that. Yeah, fuck you Samantha. Fight me. Let me attack her. I don't even care. He's happy. He's like, please take her out. I really don't want her. Wait, is she beating me? She's beating me? Wait, what do we have to do? Oh, argue. Went a little too far. Okay, okay. A little too far. Let's just argue. I heard you guys had a fairly rocky hunt honeymoon, so I'll make you guys a deal. Don't interfere with Naomi and me, and I'll return the favor. Mm-hmm. I'll try not to, but you can have a few of my fucking slaps, bitch. Alright. Oh god, what are you doing? Don't talk to my wife that way, Vinny boy. <laughs> Your business is done. No one cares. Those are fighting words. I'll poke Johnny and show him how I really feel about his him and his wife. Oh god. Right. Let me just poke him. Wow. What a mess. Where's Naomi during all this? I guess we showed them. Just hope my lawn isn't on fire when I get back home. I mean, it probably look, Naomi's so embarrassed. She's better than this. We like ignored her to fight with them. Embarrassing. Oh great, he's like coming into my stall. Being a creep. What are you what the fuck, dude? Johnny, get away from me, you fucking weirdo. My god, he took his dick out behind me. I'm very uncomfortable right now. And the frames are dropping a lot in the game for some reason. Johnny, show Vincent that he can't treat you like that. Oh my, whoa, whoa. Oh my god, everyone is fighting. <laughs> Team Vincent, Team Naomi, come on. Yes! Yes! Now, can you guys, like, fuck off? Let that be a lesson, Samantha Hayden. When you mess with Vincent, you're messing with Naomi Hunt. Ah! Oh my god, she fought for me. Ride or die, bitch. We really showed them. The nerve of those guys. I think it's best if we call it a night. I'll tell you what. I'll come over tomorrow at around 8 p.m. if that sounds good to you. Sounds great. I'll see you then. I think I've seen all that I want to do at Arcadian Plaza for now. It's best if I call it a night. I'll have to make my next date with Naomi extra special to make up for tonight's drama. Yeah. There was a lot of drama. We really showed them. Let's get out of here in case someone called the police. All right. Yeah. Let's go home. Good idea. That didn't go very well at all. Just like Greg would say, you win some and you lose some, dude. <laughs> Greg, good old Greg. Who's oh, giving me another gift? Here's a refrigerator that a Samantha Hayden ordered. Oh, nice. Well, I'll well, do that with the one I have. So. Chapter 11. Okay, that confrontation between Samantha, Johnny, and me really didn't go so well, but it's good to know that Naomi can handle herself. She doesn't seem very shaken by this at all, and that's been helping me a lot. Aw, that's cute. That's really cute. 
Naomi mentioned she'd be here at 6 p.m. I'd like to do something special for her. I know. I'll play the guitar for her. I better practice on improving my playing skills. I don't want her running for the woods. I should also shower before she arrives. Yeah, showering usually helps. All right, doing sufficient guitar skills. This is going to be the best date ever. I should brush off. Yep. All right, how many guitar skills? I think I actually have enough. Because he got one earlier when I was playing, so... Yeah, I'm pretty sure we good. we're good. Let's just take the shower. And are we hungry at all? I should have some dinner made. Oh, let's pee too. Wait, why isn't she here? Didn't say she's coming over at 6 p.m.? Okay, I guess I maybe I don't have enough guitar skills. I can't invite Naomi over if all I know is Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. I better get cracking on my guitar skills for tomorrow. Oh, I thought there would be a little thing here. We need to get to a certain level. My new rendition of Won't You Be My Toaster of Love is sure to knock her off her feet. That's the most exercise I've had all week. But my odor is as heavenly as my playing. All right, well, I guess we'll see her tomorrow then. Playing. I need this dinner too. Wait, do we even get this going? Oh, we're just about to get it. All right, you got the skill. I guess I, I must have had the skill. Oh shit, there she is. Okay. Oh, wait, don't ask sleep. Don't do that. Who are you? Whoa, you like attacked her face. Oh, Vincent, I missed you so much. So what's the plan for tonight? Hey, that new show for Love or Simoleons is on. Can we watch it together? Oh yeah, sounds great. Sounds wonderful. Let's watch it. Why don't you sit next to me? I won't bite. Um, okay, I'll try. What is he doing? I'm watching. Wait, watch TV. The show is an hour long. Okay. Watch the damn TV! That was an awesome episode, wasn't it? I didn't think her ex-boyfriend would actually kidnap her aunt. Oh my god, they're, re they're referencing Riley's story. Hey, do you have a telescope? I'd love to see the sa that satellite you've been talking so much about. Oh yeah, girl, I got a satellite. Let's go look at my uh, satellite with my telescope. Hey, where are you? Come here. She coming over? Right, there she is. Oh, Vincent, it's so beautiful. Wow, it's so bright. And, and it's made me a bajillionaire. I almost forgot I was practicing my guitar just for her. I hope she likes it. Okay, let's do that. Perform. Does it matter what we perform? Show off my awesome guitar playing skills for Naomi and we were with some rock and roll. Okay. Whoever's blowing up my phone, they need to like calm down. Oh yeah, shake your ass. Oh Vincent, I never knew you could play so well. I love this song. Never seen anyone so impressed by my guitar skills. She is impressed, right? That was great. Come here, you. Aww. This is nice. Let me save before I starve to death. I'm <laughs> joking. I think we're actually... We're good. I'm always worried I'm going to starve to death. On The Sims 2. It's so easy to do. Let's serve dinner. Naomi is everything I've ever wanted. I wonder what she'd say if I asked her to move in with me. Oh, wow. 
Naomi completes me in a way no one else ever has. It's time I asked her to move in. All right, I guess we will after this dinner. Ooh, here we go. Here we go. First, we're like, you know, make her feel good with spaghetti and meatballs. Then we ask her to move in. Alright. Let's do it. <gasps> She's gonna! I mean, why you would love, of course, like, this house is awesome. Vincent, I'd love to move in with you. So happy I finally met such a great guy. I mean, you were the only reason I stayed sane these last couple of weeks. Vincent, I'm glad I was able to make a difference in your life. You really have. It's just that ever since I got back from launching that satellite, my luck has been terrible until you came into my life. Vincent, make people make their own uh, luck. Vincent, since it's so nice out tonight, why don't, won't, don't we go sit on the lawn and watch the stars together? Everything is so perfect right now. A wonderful girl on a clear, beautiful night. Romance is in the air, burning bright and hot. It'll be great to sit on the lawn together and stargaze. Oh, boy. Right, let's stargaze. Wait, is she coming with me? No, girl. Can you stargaze with me? Robin. Yeah, I'm not. Oh. Um. Shoot, I can't get her to do it. Stargaze. <laughs> Calm down. Right, look. Go to sleep for like a second. Right, can we watch clouds? Does that count? Oh my god, this isn't working out. We're gonna have to invite her over again. He's like having issues for some reason. Well, she lives here now though, so I guess it's not a big deal. And we have the day off, so I guess we'll just sleep. Go to sleep. What is he doing? Jeez. All right. Hopefully we can get her to stargaze now. Okay, now she's sleeping. Wake up. Oh wait, I can control her. I didn't even realize. I have to join stargazing. Can you two just please stargaze? like so difficult there we go finally Vincent nothing can spoil this night what's that uh, 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 oh, 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 oh my god uh, is she alive under there oh, oh, oh my god well rip oh okay hey grim Oh my god, uh, this is terrible I'm with my own satellite. Oh, Naomi, if I pled my case with Grim Reaper, maybe it will return her to me. Right, let's plead for loved one. Oh my god. <laughs> it's so silly. I love it. Poor Vincent, he just wants to be loved by someone good to him. Uh, your request intrigues me, mortal. I will give you what you ask, but on one condition. I will return Naomi to you, but you will forfeit all your earthly belongings. You must value her more than your own worth. So do we have a deal? Hmm. How long we know Naomi for? Like, you know, like a month? You know, we got three million in the bank. I have to give that up. Mmm. <laughs> nah, we good. Don't worry, I'll look at the other option too. We're gonna actually look at both. I'll reload and look at it. Bye, girl. Keeping my house. Keeping my money. Very well, mortal. A heart as cold and hard as yours deserves a suitable companion. Farewell. Damn, she has a nice tombstone. 
Chapter 12. The regret over what happened to Naomi will stay with me for the rest of my life, but my entire fortune was too much to risk on something so uncertain. Love is beautiful, but it is fleeting. Only simoleons can launch satellites. And she got a real nice little... Ooh, it's titties outside. What does that say? You've reached the end. All right, you can just pretty much control him then. Wait, where's, why is she back here? Why is she back here? No. Me no want. Let me do this. Does it say anything? No, okay. That might have been Sims 3 that started, where you could read what it said. All right, well, let's, uh, I guess I'll reload and see what happens if she stays with him. I'm sure it's just one of those, like, chapter things, but that's okay. We'll take a look. No, don't save. Okay, so apparently it didn't save. Well, I know for a matter of a fact that the ending isn't really that great. It's whatever. They, I think pretty sure he gets rich again with Naomi and they live happily ever after. I'm not going to replay to get that. I don't know. That's so annoying though. I saved the game. Like I never resaved it. You know, I'm going to make my own happy ending. I know just exactly what I'm going to do. So, hold on to your bootstraps because we're going in to Vincent's life. We're going to make things way better than they ever were with Naomi. She's over. She's done. Whatever. Do we? No one cleaned up the satellite. Whatever. The maid will get it in the morning. All right. So it's 1230 a.m. I'm actually going to go to sleep. He, he's going to go to sleep because he has a really important phone call to make in the morning for his new girl. All right. Time's call her up. No spoilers. And here she is in all shaking glory. Alexa, the one we should have been with forever. No wonder. Naomi died. It just wasn't meant to be. You are my true. You're my true soulmate, Alexa. I'm gonna shake with you. She's literally shaking. I know Greg likes her, but like, not. Nah. She deserves a real man. Look at us. Look at this package. Package. You have to say it that way because that's what is a truly magnificent artifact of humanity. Let me flirt with you now. Oh, yeah. I know you can't contain yourself, Alexa. I know you're nervous. But it's finally happening. Oh my god, kids are up her arm. Feel the shakes on your lips. <laughs> wait, 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 we need to get her a cup of coffee. What are we doing? Wait, why are we doing that? Yo, I'm trying to kiss you, girl. Oh my gosh, she's ready to like... Wait, what negative? Did she not like it? Or was that for something else? Isn't she good with me? Um, what are we doing? Okay. See, I couldn't do this with Naomi. She didn't have special powers like this. She couldn't shake the Rador. She was a loser. Oh, no. Do it. Lay down the moves right next to the toilet. Why do you still know? Please. Wait, whoa! What happened? They were enjoying themselves. Did she leave? Alexa, don't leave me. No. Come back. All right. We're gonna eat and then just come back over. She will be mine. Oh, you're still here. Oh, well, where did you go? Were you we're in the pool? Will you kiss me now? See you later. Oh my god. No, right. 
Yeah, right as I'm about to lay it down on her. Look, Brittany, no. Pretty, I never wanted to be with you. I just used you. All right, Alexa, come back. All right, she's coming over. She's here. Oh, there's a kiss. Jeez. Oh, my God. Wow. <laughs> Brittany's no longer a friend. Look, I've been trying to friend zone you for, like, years now. Finally. Well, I guess she's no longer a friend, so she's not in the friend zone anymore. <laughs> Oh my god, everyone, no one's my friend anymore. What? Greg is no longer best friends. Sherman? What? Oh my, I guess Greg was really mad about me stealing Alexa from him. But why is Sherman mad at me? I mean, I guess I violated the bro code. Whatever. I don't even care. It's all for you, Alexa. Shake on me. Shake on me and we'll be happy forever. Mm. Mm. This is the way it should have ended. She's not shaking anymore. Oh, my God. Oh. She's not shaking anymore, you guys. She's finally happy. Uh, this is so cute. This is so much better. I'm going to leave it here. Oh, my God. She's not shaking. <laughs> this is a beautiful story. Dang, Alexa's joined the family with 100K. Hey. Nice. I mean, we're bringing 3 million to the family, but, like, you know, that's really respectable. Greg, I thought you weren't my friend anymore. Why didn't you fucking leave? Yeah, I stole your girlfriend. I'll do it again. There's actually a really special thing we need to do. And no spoilers. I'm about to figure it out. In one second, you guys find out how Alexa and Vincent will spend the rest of their days. Oh my god, she's out. Naomi, she knows Alexa's here. Oh my god, she's come to haunt us. She knows we're gonna ba ba woohoo for the rest of our lives together. She's so jealous. Oh my god. Drama. She's out. She's gone. Hopefully never coming back. Thought I already lost her. Now here she is as a ghost. I just want to ba ba woohoo for the rest of my life with Alexa. <gasps> what the fuck? Oh my god. Well, okay. <laughs> that was interesting. Alright, guys, have a great night. Ba ba woohoo.